In-game fashion collaborators confirmed for need for speed unbound. Gameplay and cars details. The first details of the game were leaked by Jeff Grab, who mentioned that the game's aesthetic would borrow from anime. That turned out to be true when the game was unveiled, showing a blend of realistic style and anime effects coming out of cars, though these can be disabled. Character models are also cell shaded and the overall visuals are heavily graffiti-inspired. A bit of time after the game's initial reveal, EA revealed the game's expansive car list, which can be seen at this link. Various brands can be found within, including Chevrolet, Dodge, BMW, Ferrari, Lamborghini, and more, will be available for players to drive and unlock throughout the game, though given the presentation and art style, the fact that cars like the Toyota AE86 Trueno are missing is outright criminal. A grand total of 143 vehicles will be available to players at launch, excluding the four unique cars within the Palace Edition. As for gameplay, there's a risk versus reward with every race, or overworld driving, really, that players enter. Certain actions throughout the in-game weeks will be high payouts or high entry fees, and players will also be able to bet against other racers. Police chases very evidently return, as they can find you and chase you throughout the game world. If the game's trailers are anything to go off of, the police are a fair bit more refined and aggressive than they were in games like NFS Heat or Most Wanted 2012. Anyways, it is unclear if the police would have weapons like spike strips or EMPs in their arsenal, the roadblocks make a return. The fictional Lakeshore City is based on Chicago. The heat system from Need for Speed Heat will also come back. The latest game to the Need for Speed Street Racing franchise, Need for Speed Unbound has been generating buzz ahead of its release, from a special Palace Skateboards edition to an ASAP Rocky character with a DTM-inspired Mercedes-Benz 190 EVO, complete with custom branding. Revealed by Electronic Arts and Criterion Games, Need for Speed Unbound will also feature branded fashion for the players to dress their in-game characters. The list of fashion collaborators is curated by Tony Blaze Ibequer, editor-in-chief of Wonderland magazine, who stated that with these partnerships, we're blurring the lines between IRL and digital content, and my main hope is that fans adopt the freedom to express themselves through clothing and apply some of their daring in-game choices in real life. The lineup of brands featured in the game includes Palace Skateboards, Versace, Puma, Namilia, Danielle Gizio, Alpha Industries, AWGE, Born X Raised, Brain Dead, Champion, Edwin, Fila, GCDS, Chris Joy, MKI Miyuki Zoku, Napa Pajiri, Vans, and more. Both Need for Speed Unbound and Need for Speed Unbound Palace Edition will be available worldwide December 2nd for Sony PlayStation 5. Microsoft Xbox Series X slash S, and PC via the EA app, Origin, Steam and Epic Game Store, for $70 and $80 US dollars respectively. PC System Requirements and Features PC players will want to pay attention here, as the Epic Game Store page for Need for Speed Unbound has the games required and recommended hardware. To even run Need for Speed Unbound, you'll need to have the following specifications. OS Windows 10 64-bit CPU Ryzen 5 2600, Core i5-8600 Memory 8GB Storage 50GB DirectX version 124 GPU RX 570, GTX 1050T Meanwhile, the game's recommended specs are as follows. OS Windows 10 64-bit CPU Ryzen 5 3600, Core i7-8700 Memory 16GB Storage 50GB DirectX version 12 GPU Radeon RX 5700, 8GB, GeForce RTX 2070, 8GB Visiting Need for Speed Unbound Steam page will reveal that the game has NVIDIA DLSS support for higher frame rates and resolutions, though we don't know yet if that is DLSS 2 or DLSS 3.
The game will also support HDR10 displays. Variable refresh rate support is available on PC builds of the game, allowing for less screen tear and smoother picture quality. Release date, pricing, platforms. Need for Speed Unbound will launch on December 2, 2022, for PlayStation 5, Xbox Series, and PC via Steam, the Epic Game Store, and the Origin Store. Pre-orders are open right now, and the game is being sold at a base price of $69.99. Pre-orders will get players the following. A unique driving effect. A unique license plate. Unique banner artwork and sticker. $150,000 in multiplayer funds. A deluxe edition of Need for Speed Unbound is also available, the Palace Edition. Players who purchase the Palace Edition gain access to the following. The game. For stunningly intense custom cars. New gassy driving effects. A Mashman-themed decal and license plate pack. An exclusive character pose and banner artwork. A special clothing pack with 20 unique items. If pre-ordered, a unique driving effect. If pre-ordered, a unique license plate. If pre-ordered, unique banner artwork and sticker. If pre-ordered, $150,000 in multiplayer funds. Need for Speed Unbound's Palace Edition will run you $79.99 from whichever storefront you plan to buy it from. Unfortunately, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One users will have to sit this game out since there won't be any last-gen versions in development.